Hello. Hello, teacher. Hey. How are you? How are you doing? Good evening. I'm doing great. It's a new week. It's Monday. How you doing, people? How you doing tonight? Fine, teacher. Fine. Wow, it's a pleasure to see you. Connected. Hey, teacher. Good night. Good evening. Good evening. Yes. Good evening is Good evening, hello. Teacher. Hello, right? Good evening. Goodbye. It's good night. Okay. So, you guys completed your exercises on the platform? Yes, teacher. You did the exam? Did you do the exam? Yes, I am. Okay. If you did the exam, you're fine. Yes. ¿Quién levantó yes. la mano? Let me see. Let me see. Carlos. Oh, no. Cindy Figueroa. Uh -huh. Quería decirnos algo, Miss, Miss Cindy María Los Figueroa. Nos quería dar unas palabras alusivas o algo así. No sé de qué están hablando, acabo de entrar. Ah, okay. como usted entró ahí con la mano levantadita, yo pensé que nos quería decir unas palabras. Hola, ya estoy aquí, no sé de qué, de qué quieren que, de qué se trata. Estamos hablando del mes del amor y la amistad. Ah, bueno, pues para mí todos los días, ¿verdad? Es el día uh, del amor y la amistad, pues sí, porque todos los días hay que demostrarlo, no solamente eso. el 14 de febrero. Ahora ya todo es puro consumismo, pero si me quieren regalar algo por ese día, pues no me enojo también. Excelente, vaya chicos, vaya chicas, tomamos nota ahí, por favor. All right, five minutes practice. Five minutes practice. What do you I, remember? What do you remember from yesterday's? Well, not yesterday's, but Friday's class. Do you remember Friday's class? What was the topic about? Uh, Make memory. What? WH4. WH question. WH questions. Ah, that's interesting. We did see, we did see about adjectives. Adjectives. Ah, do you remember adjectives? She. What adjective do you remember from Friday's class? Let me see. Let me hear you. Give me some adjectives. Give me adjectives. Friday, who, what, when, where? No, those are the WH words. Those are the WH words. I'm asking you for adjectives. Hanson. Hanson. Thank you. Thank you. That's for me. Intelligent. Uh, <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. What do father like? Um, Handsome. Father... Intelligent. Um, beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful. Pretty. And Pretty. Funny, funny. funny. Quiet. <laughs> Quiet. Quiet. Talkative. Sure. Talkative. Friendly. Angry. 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 Funny. funny. Bueno, ahí está. Ha, bueno, sí, está Dios. hungry, que es con hambre, y está angry, que es enojado. So be careful ahí con esa pronunciación. Hambriento es hungry, con H, hungry. hungry. Y enojado es angry. Angry. Angry beer. Angry beers. <laughs> angry, angry birds. Angry birds. birds. Eh, yes. Sí, porque beer es, es cerveza, entonces. Ah. <laughs> ah beer and bird. <laughs> Number. Okay, so um, there are some adjectives that are very useful Sad. to describe. Adjectives are useful to describe, to describe a person, to describe an animal, or to describe a thing, okay? There are two categories of... Uh, adjectives okay pay attention 
We have adjectives to describe your appearance. Repeat, appearance. 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 You're looking, appearance. you're looking, appearance. you're serious, appearance. you're smiling, appearance. you're angry, you're quiet, you're shy, right? There are there are adjectives to describe appearance. For example, you're right. heavy, pretty. heavy, pretty, pretty. Handsome. handsome, short, handsome. Short. tall. Thin. Thin. Small. Serious. Serious. Wait. Ahora. Appearance. appearance. There are other adjectives that are useful to describe personality. So well, we have appearance and we have personality. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's mention adjectives to describe personality. Friendly. Yes. Funny. Friendly, serious, talkative. funny. Friendly. Talkative. Talkative. Yes. Talkative. Just like you, Andrea. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Entonces, sí, eh, bonito que aprendamos que hay diferencia, ¿verdad? Hay para describir uh, apariencia física y hay también para describir personalidad, ¿verdad? Ok. So with that being said, también vimos las WH words. Okay, Cindy. <laughs> All right, vamos ahorita a call the attendance que después me emociono y se nos va el tiempo. Okay, let's start with Adam Isaías Cornejo Ramírez. Adam Wilfredo Arevalo Linares. Thank you, teacher. Alan Enrique Rosales Sorto. Present, teacher. Alexandra Milena Rendón Saldaña. Present teacher. Ana Gabriela Murillo Martínez. Ana Margarita Márquez de Castillo. Present teacher. Ana Noemí Hernández de Moreira. I'm here teacher. Andrea Elizabeth González Burgos. Andrea Geraldine Sánchez Recinos. Present. Ángel René Esquivel Landa Verde. I'm here, teacher. Ángela María Parada Castro. Present, teacher. Antonio Alberto Martínez Pérez. I'm here, teacher. Bernardo Antonio Herrera Díaz. Blanca Elizabeth Fuentes Menéndez. Present, teacher. Blanca Jamilet Aquino Villamariona. Present teacher. Thank you. Brenda Maricela Tovar Aguilar. Brian Isaac Escamilla Hernandez. Here I am. Thank you, sir. Carlos Alejandro Perez Caravantes. Carlos Fernando Portillo Rivas. I'm here. Carlos Manuel Ramos Epera. Carmen Guadalupe Escamilla Orantes. Present teacher. Carmen Lisette Santillana de Retana. Present teacher. Cesar Alejandro Ramos Cepeda. Here I am. Cindy Marielos Figueroa Mejia. I'm here, teacher. Present. Thank you. Claudia Lisette Lopez Alvarado. Present teacher. Perfect. Dalila del Carmen Romero Guerra. Present. Daniela Alejandra Candray Galvez. David Antonio López Torres. David Benjamin Aguirre Ayala. Present. David Ezequiel Sánchez Muñoz. I am here. Oh, perfect, perfect, perfect. Mira, pues ya me había... Ok, aquí estamos. Ok, guys, aprovechemos entonces. Let's share my screen. Eh, recordándoles, pues, friendly reminders, ¿verdad? Lo del micrófono, lo de tener sus cámaras activadas, ¿verdad? Lo de la participación constante y lo de la um, completación de su plataforma. Todos tenemos que ir al día. No sé si... Se fijan ustedes que si sí hay un equipo ahí detrás de nosotros que nos recuerda, ¿verdad? 
um, que tenemos esa tarea pendiente, que es un requisito, ¿verdad? Yo los quiero ver en el siguiente nivel, guys. Okay. Y para eso tienen que tener la asistencia arriba del 80%. Igual la plataforma tienen que tenerla completa. Así que les animo que si están atrasados, que nos pongamos al día, por favor. Ok. So, comenzando chicos. Lesson four. We have the objective tonight. And it says, in this class, you will be, or you will learn clothes vocabulary. Um, particularly clothes which you wear for your work or for leisure. Bueno, aprendamos un verbo nuevo. El verbo es wear. W-E-A-R. Se pronuncia igualito que la palabra W-H word, que significa donde. Wear. Solo para cuestión de pronunciación. Aprendámonos este verbo. Where. where, where, vamos a usar where con clothes, ropa, and accessory. No vamos usar. a usar el verbo usar, ok? El verbo usar se dice use. En inglés decimos we use. Cuando estamos hablando de una computadora, cuando estamos hablando de una herramienta, ¿verdad? We use. I want to one dollars. <ríe> ok, entonces use es para herramientas, ok. Para ropa, para accesorios vamos a usar wear. Por ejemplo, I wear jeans, I wear tennis shoes, I wear sunglasses. No, vamos a decir use. Be careful with that. Ok, so let's talk about this new vocabulary. Watch pronunciation. Watch pronunciation. Here we go. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn clothes vocabulary, particularly clothes which you wear for work and for leisure. As you can see on the screen, the clothes which are on the image towards the left hand side are for work, and the ones towards the right hand side are clothes for leisure. Let's practice by listening and repeating the vocabulary. Listen and repeat. Clothes for work. Clothes for work. Clothes for work. Say clothes for work. Clothes for work. Clothes for work. Shirt. Repeat. Shirt. 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 How do you spell shirt? Shirt. Yes, it's S H I R T. Shirt. 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 Repeat. Shirt. Tie. 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 How do you spell tie? T I E. T I E. Excellent. Next. T I E. Belt. 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 Could you please spell belt? B E L T. Excellent. B E T. It's B E L T. Belt. B -E -L -T. Jacket. 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 Puede jacket. ser que también yeah. se le diga jacket a, a una como chamarra, ¿verdad? Es una jacket. ¿Ok? How do you spell jacket? J A C E T. Repeat, repeat, jacket. Jacket. J A C E T. K A E T. Next. J A C E T. Repeat. Pants. 
These are formal, okay, guys? These are formal pants. How do you spell formal. pants? These are formal pants. Pants. Ok, y ahora las dos cosas Jacket and pants ¿Cómo se diría? Sweet Suit Jackets and pants Suit 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 Entonces quiere decir que letter, letter I is silent You don't pronounce letter I You just pronounce suit Suit. Suit. And remember, suit is the combination of the jacket and the pants. Okay. Traje, correcto. Continue. Coat. Coat. Bueno, antes antes de pasar a coat, regresemos con suit. Ustedes me dijeron suit. ¿Verdad? Quizás vieron la palabra uh, dulce, ¿verdad? Sweet. S-W-E-E-T. Sweet. Sweet. Es dulce. ¿Y esta otra palabra cómo se pronuncia? La que acabo de chatear. Sweet. 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 Esas dos palabras que acabo de chatear se pronuncian igual. Sweet. La primera es dulce, ¿ok? Y la segunda también se pronuncia sweet. Pero sweet. este sweet es de, de una... Sweet. En un hotel, ¿verdad? Hablando de un hotel, de una suite, correcto. De un apartamentito, uh -huh. ¿verdad? Una suite ya más de lujo, ¿ok? Entonces, aclarando eso. Ahora, sin la E, es el traje. Suit. ¿Ok? Be careful with that pronunciation. Pónganlas aparte ahí. Y vámonos con coat. Repeat, coat. 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 Could you please spell coat for me? C-O-A-T. Coat. Correct. Next. Shoes. 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 Okay. Shoes. 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 Shoes.
Next. Klaus. 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 Blouse. Blouse. Okay, class, Blouse. could you please spell bla uh, blouse for me? Blouse. B O O U E. B L O U S E. L O U S E. Pronunciamos esa L. 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 In blouse, 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 and blouse, arf, blouse, arf, scarf, arf, scarf, 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 scarf. Si pronunciamos la letra S al principio y la letra F al final, scarf, 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 scarf. It that means bufanda, right? Scarf, scarf. Si yo quiero describir el color de la bufanda, acuérdense que el color tiene que ir antes del noun. But color plus noun. Si el noun es scarf, yo voy a decir a green scarf. A green scarf. Si los pantalones son azules, yo voy a decir blue pants. Pants. pants porque estamos hablando de formales pants. ahorita estamos en formales los jeans ya vamos a pasar a lo informal next okay. falda skirt skirt repeat blouse blouse scarf Scarf. Skirt. 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 Uy, Star. chicos, por favor, me van a Star. me van a dejar sordo. Ok, Star. entonces no tienen que decir eh, skirt, sino skirt. Skirt. Correcto. Skirt. Y para decir, para decir mini falda, ¿cómo sería? No, igual se dice mini, mini skirt. Mini skirt. Mini skirt. Mini skirt. All right, next. Oh, wait. How do you spell skirt? High heels. High heels. High heels. High heels. High heels. High heels. High heels, de tacones. High heels. 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 Correct. High heels. High heels. High heels. High heels. Hi. Hi. And now you know that high heels mean in Spanish tacones, okay? High heels. High heel coat. Raincoat. 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 Es para la lluvia, ¿verdad? Very well. Raincoat. Coat. Rain. Coat. Rain. Rain, the Coat. Rain. 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 Rain.
coat de abrigo. Raincoat. Raincoat. And the last one is dress. 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 Remember, all of these, what type of clothes is it? It's clothes for work. Clothes. For work. For work. For work. For work. Now let's go to the other side. It says clothes for leisure. ¿Qué quiere decir leisure? Leisure. Es todo lo que no es trabajo, ¿verdad? Ropa de relax, right? Para sentirse cómodo, ropa para el frío, toda la ropa que no tiene que ver con el trabajo. Clothes for leisure. Clothes for leisure. Hat. 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 Y fíjense en esa palabrita hat. 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 hat puede ser un gorro, ok, o puede ser un sombrero también, ok, puede ser un gorro o puede ser un sombrero. Hat. hat. Ojo, que es como homofón con esta palabra, la palabra caliente, ¿cómo se dice? Hot. 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 Es la misma pronunciación. Ojo. Mm. Ok. Very good. Continue. Sweater. 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 Sí. La T se pronuncia como R, ¿verdad? Sweater. 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 Los que les gusta ir ahí a tomando notas, asociando. Sweater viene de la palabra sweat. Más bien dicho del verbo sweat. ¿Quién sabe qué significa sweat? Solo sweat significa sudar. ¿Ok? Ya la palabra sweater. Es el suéter que nosotros decimos. Next. Jeans. Jeans. Y aquí sí entran los pantalones de lona, ¿verdad? Jeans. Guys, hay una diferencia entre pants versus jeans, right? Formal es pants. And informal es pants. Jeans. Yes. Ahora, acuérdense Jeans. que antes del noun de, ponemos el color, ¿verdad? Para describir, ¿verdad? Eh, entonces ahora ahí podemos entender, ¿verdad? Que nos equivocábamos cuando decíamos pasame los, los, los blue jeans negros, ¿verdad? Entonces nosotros teníamos eso de decir Pero blue jeans. Blue negro. Correcto. Entonces, blue jeans es pantalones no. de lona Azul, ¿verdad? Azul. Si no es así, pues tenemos que cambiarle el color. Black jeans, white jeans, etc. White jeans. Yes. ¿Estamos claros ahí? Yes. 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 Gloves. 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 Estamos mejorando con ese spelling, guys. G L O V E S. Gloves. Next. Boots. Boots. 
Boots. Y esto puede ser femenino o masculino, ¿verdad? Boots. How do you spell cap? C A P. C A P. Cap. 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 Do you do you like caps? Yes. Do you, do you like caps? No. <laughs> so, so, okay. Cap significa gorra. En una forma informal puede significar como bromear, como, como bromear, pero ya en una forma inf informal, ¿verdad? I don't cap. I don't like to cap. Right? Okay. Next. T-shirt. 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 What is the meaning of T-shirt? T-shirt. T-shirt. What's a T-shirt? Camiseta. Okay, okay. Vaya, entonces, mucho cuidado ahí con pronunciar camiseta y con pronunciar profesor, ¿verdad? Porque alguien me decía, mire, óigame camiseta, me decía, hey, t-shirt, hey, t-shirt, no, I'm your teacher, I'm your teacher, I'm not your t-shirt. T-shirt. <laughs> Pero como nosotros ahí vamos como, como con los, bien cariñoseando ahí con las palabras, ¿verdad? Entonces, t-shirt, por querérmelo decir cariñosamente, right Me estaba diciendo otra cosa, right sí. no. Entonces, t-shirt. ¿Cómo es la diferencia? Ay, la diferencia es que el sonido che, che, che. por ejemplo, teacher, teacher. Pronounce teacher. 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 That's me. Teacher. That's me, right? Teacher. Teacher Kaleb, right? Teacher. And the other one is T shirt. 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 T-shirt. ¿Se entiende ahí la diferencia? T-shirt. T-shirt. Yes. T-shirt. Ojo, que ahí va solo la letra T, ¿verdad? T y de luego va un dash, que es un guión. T, dash, S-H-I-R-T. T-shirt. De lo contrario, si solo es shirt, es la camisa así, ¿verdad? Manga larga formal. Si dice T-shirt, es la camiseta. Ok. Short. 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 Otra vez. Short. 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 Y pronunciamos la letra S al final. Short. Short. Porque son dos piernas. Plural. Okay. Short. 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 Socks. 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 Sneakers. 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 Guys, pronunciamos la S al principio. Sneakers. No vamos a decir Sneakers. S, sino que Sneakers. Sneakers. Correcto. Sneakers. Y al final Sneakers. también porque es plural. Sneakers. 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 What is the meaning? What is the meaning of sneakers? I don't know. Tennis. 
sí. zapatillas de presión. Todo lo que tiene que ver con, bueno, nosotros le decimos, sí, 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 eh, tenis, ¿verdad? Tenis shoes. La diferencia es que shoes son los zapatos de lustre, guys. Son los zapatos formales. Los sneakers son todos los zapatos deportivos. Sí, se dice igual que el chocolate sneaker, ¿verdad? Entonces, sneakers. Sneakers son sus zapatos tenis, sneakers. sus zapatos adidas, todas esas marcas, ¿verdad? Deportivas. Right? Tenis decimos nosotros. Sneakers. Sneakers. Next. Pajamas. 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 Do you like pajamas? Pajamas. 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 Escuchamos otra vez esa pronunciación, por favor. Everybody silent. I want to check. Pajamas. 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 Do you do you wear pajamas? Pajamas. Pajamas. Do I don't wear pajamas? You don't wear pajamas? Okay. You do? You do wear pajamas? Okay. Okay. Next. Swim. Swim. Con M. Swim. 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 Swim suit. Swim Swim My swim suit. What is a swim suit? My swim suit. Es un traje. Traje de baño. De baño. All right. Repetition. One more time. Repetition. Everybody repeating. Everybody repeating. Swim suit. Swim suit. Swim suit. Sneakers. Socks. Socks. Shorts. Socks. Shorts. Shorts. T-shirt. 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 Sweater. 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 for work. Repeat. Dress. 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 Clothes. Raincoat. 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 No es solo un heels, heels no, heels. heels. Hay un doble sonido ahí, si ven que hay dos letras E ahí. ¿Cómo se dice la letra E? ¿Cómo se dice la letra E en el alfabeto? Entonces ahí, io, io, high heels. Muy bien. Repeat, skirt. 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 No me diga e, skirt, que ahí no hay una e al principio. Skirt. Es la S. Skirt. 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 Skirt.
Shoot. 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 Pants. 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 Jacket. 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 Suit. Coat. 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 Belt. Belt. Tie. Tie. Shirt. 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 Nice job. Now it's your turn to practice the vocabulary that we just learned. For you to talk about the clothes that you wear for work and the clothes that you wear for leisure. If the clothes are not mentioned here, you should add them. For example, I wear a tie for work. I wear shorts at home. After you do this, please share your work in our discussion forums. All right, guys, let's prepare examples. Let's prepare examples of what do you like, what do you wear for work? For example, I wear, siempre vamos a usar el verbo I wear. I wear. For example, I wear, me, I wear a tie wear, in a wear. shirt for work, at work, at work. This is me. I wear, I, I wear a tie in a shirt at work. I wear a tie and I wear. I wear pajamas at night. I wear pajamas. I wear pajamas at night. Pajamas. What? What? What do you? What do you wear on at work? At work. What do you wear at work? In work, I wear, I wear at work a suit. A suit? Do you do you wear a suit, Adam? Uh, no, realmente. Not really. <laughs> not really. Ejemplo. Ah, okay, okay. I wear a suit at work. Repeat. I wear. A suit. Aquí ya comenzamos a destrabar, ¿verdad? Porque wear, wear, damos un círculo. Wear. I wear sandals. I wear, I wear jeans. I wear skirts. Ojo, cuando es una cosa, agregamos a. Por ejemplo, yo les puse a ustedes, I wear a tie. Yo uso, yo visto una. Corbata, a tie, ok, a shirt, right, pero si ya son pantalones formales, no vamos a usar a, solo decimos pants, I wear pants, I wear pants, I wear pants, I wear jeans, hey, what clothes do you wear in your house? Uh, I wear I wear uh, shorts. I wear I wear shorts. I wear shorts in shirt. In a in a in a t-shirt. T-shirt. Ah, t-shirt es singular, verdad? Entonces vamos a decir I wear a. I wear a t-shirt. I wear a t-shirt. Correct. I wear a t-shirt. I wear blue jeans. I wear jeans. Sneakers. Oh, no podemos decir, no podemos decir a jeans. No, porque jeans es plural. No podemos decir a shorts. No, porque shorts es plural. Sí, me es. Y cuando son pantalones deportivos, pants or sería. Como, como, como para hacer ejercicio. 
Ajá, o sea, de los que, ajá. Sería pants. Pants. Sport. Sport pants. Sport pants. Sport. Se podría decir pants porque es más informal. Vamos a decir sport pants. Sport pants. Sport pants. Somos como pantaloncillos deportivos. Right? Okay, Sport what pants. do you what do you wear? What do you wear for leisure? What do you wear for leisure? I wear jeans, <laughs> wear a and shorts, and shirts. <laughs> what do you wear for a cold weather? Cold. I wear a sweater. I wear, I wear, I wear, I wear a sweater. What else? A hat. Four pants. A hat. And yeah, a hat. And I wear a pajama. Gloves. 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 That's Gloves. right. Gloves. What's your favorite? What's your favorite clothes? What's your favorite clothes? Pajamas. Pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> all right all right what's your favorite clothes andrea sanchez i don't know your favorite 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 shirt and jeans uh t-shirt and jeans Yes. Okay, okay, like like sport, sport clothes, right? Okay, what about you, Blanca Fuentes? What's your favorite clothes? What's your favorite clothes, Blanca Fuentes? Aha, uh -huh. you understand English? Yes. Uh, um, I wear shorts. Shorts? Um, I wear shorts and heels. Heels. Oh, nobody said high heels. All right, all right. What about Daniela Candrai? What are you? What are you? I don't see your camera activated. Vamos a ver. Let's continue. Let's continue. Bueno, entonces eso era clothes, right? Type of clothes. Types of clothes. Okay, se me fue esta pantallita aquí. Okay, vamos otra vez. Here we go. One second, guys, que se me ha descodificado esto. One second. Ahorita no estoy compartiendo. Oh, sí, estoy compartiendo. No, ¿verdad? No, no, teacher. no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. No camiseta, le dijeron por ahí. No t-shirt. Hey, come on. Hey. Ok, ya no me dejó compartir. Le agarró la locura a esto. Permítanme. Let's see, let's see. Share, share, share. share. No, ya no me dejó compartir por alguna razón. Aquí está, aquí está, aquí está. Ok. So let's move on, guys. Let's move on. Okay, so in this class, we will learn colors. Let's talk about colors. Let's check it out. Hi, everyone. In this class, you will learn colors and you will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real conversation. Let's start by looking at the image on the screen and listening to the colors. You should listen and repeat. White. 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 Listen to the colors. White. 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 Perfect. Perfect. White. Gray. White. Light. Gray. Light. Gray. Light. Gray. Light. Gray. Light. Gray. Bueno, antes que nada, tenemos que clarificar dos palabras, ¿verdad? que son las que modifican a los colores, ya sea la palabra light 
Repeat. Light. 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 Dark. 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 Light Dark. gray is un gris claro. Claro. Yeah. Right. Más claro. suave. Yeah. Correcto. Lo, lo, lo aclara, ¿verdad? Lo suaviza. Caso opuesto con dark. Correcto. Correcto. Entonces, la forma oscura ah. del color. Let's go again. One more time. Light gray. Light gray. Light gray. No es gray, light, gray, light, but light gray, como un visito claro. Gray. 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 Dark gray. Dark gray. What color is dark gray? Gris oscuro. Es un gris oscuro. No. That's right. Continue. Beige. 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 Light brown. Light brown. Light brown. Es un café claro. Light brown. Light brown. Brown. Light brown. 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 brown, dark brown, dark brown, dark brown, dark brown, dark brown. Dark brown. Dark brown. Es un café oscuro. Black, 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 black. Permítanme, chicos, permítanme. Hola, hola. Ahorita. No, ahí está ese, ya voy a salir yo, ahí está ese. Ya voy a salir. Sorry, chicos, sorry. Ok, let's move on. Red. 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 Pink. 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 Orange. Pink. Orange. 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 Yellow. 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 No me digan J. Cada vez que le pegan la J es el sonido de la I y la E. Yellow. Pronunciamos la vocal. Yellow. 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 Si usted me dice yellow, yellow. yellow está mal. Yellow. Ok. Yellow. 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 Cuando usted dice el, el pronombre usted, ¿cómo se dice usted? A ver. Yellow. You. Yellow. 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 You. You. Se dice you o se dice you. 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 A ver, chicos. You. You. Se dice you. you. Or se dice you. 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 Con las vocales. Ok. You. Vamos otra vez. Yellow. 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 Light green. 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 Light blue. Light blue. Bueno, abajo, vamos abajo. Tenemos purple. 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 Repeat. Purple. 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 Repeat. Purple. Dark blue. Purple. Dark blue. 
Dark blue. Dark blue. Light blue. Light blue. Light blue. Light blue. Light blue. So in singular, in singular, I can ask you, what's your favorite color? Repeat, guys. What's your favorite color? What's your favorite color? Repeat, favorite. What's your favorite? Favorite. What's your favorite color? What's your favorite color? Para hacer en plural. What are your favorite colors? What are your favorite colors? Vamos a ver quién está con la cámara activada. Let me see, Carlos Fernando Portillo. What are your favorite colors? Blue. Complete, complete. My. My favorite color is blue. Correct, my friend. Okay, Carmen Escamilla, what's your favorite color? My favorite. My favorite color is blue. Blue. My favorite color is orange. My favorite color is orange. Can you repeat that, Carmen? My favorite color Right. Okay, what about you, Antonio Martinez? What's your favorite color, Antonio? My favorite color is black and white. Oh, so you have two favorite colors. So yes. your answer is plural. You will say, my favorite are. colors are... Can you repeat? Okay, my, my favorite colors are... Ah, lo siento. <laughs> ¿Cuáles eran? ¿Eran blue? blue. No, este, black, no, black, and black and white. Black and white. And white. Ah, no, hombre, el bien y el mal ahí, yeah. pues. Ok. <laughs> <laughs> ok, that's ok. All right, let me hear you, Claudia López. What are your favorite colors? My favorite color is black. Black. Cuidadito, pues. Ok, rock and roll. <laughs> what about Carlos Manuel? What's your favorite color? Dark is blue. Speak up, speak up. I can hear you. My favorite color is blue. Blue? Ok, like El Salvador's flag is blue and white, right? National colors. That's good. That's good. What about you, Alan Rosales? What's your favorite color, sir? Uh, my favorite color is uh, light blue. Light blue. Oh, like the ocean. Nice. What about you, Carmen Santillana? What's your favorite color? My favorite color is red. Red. <gasps> like passion. Like love. <laughs> All right. What about you, Ana Margarita? What's your favorite color? My favorite color, red. Is. My favorite color it is. Is red. Repeat, repeat. My favorite color. It's red. It's red. What about it you, Ana Narevalo? What's your favorite color? Hello. I have two favorite color too. Uh, my favorite color are green and blue. Green and blue. And blue. Hmm. Yes. Eso tiene un significado, creo yo. Por ahí viene. <laughs> Por ahí viene la cosa. <laughs> what about you, Ana Moreira? What's your favorite color? Mm, I, my favorite color t-shirt is white and pink. White and pink. Miren que ustedes tienen unas dos combinaciones, ¿verdad? Seria, Bien. ¿verdad? <laughs> <laughs> All right. ¿Quién más tenía? Ah, René. What about you, René? What's your favorite color? My favorite color is purple. Purple. That's different. Yes, That's different. <laughs> wow. A man that likes purple color. What about <laughs> you, Andrea? What's your favorite color? Uh, my favorite color is pink. 
think I knew it. Lo sabía. Lo sabía. Ok, guys. Vamos a ver quién más me ha faltado acá. ¿Verdad que en el color azul marino sería blue navy? Correct. Ah. Correct. Hey, vamos a terminar con la asistencia. Bernardo Antonio Herrera Díaz. No, ¿verdad? Ok, vámonos aquí con Adán Isaías Cornejo Ramírez. Ana Gabriela Murillo Martínez. Andrea Elizabeth González Burgos. Teacher. Excellent, Gabriela. Let me see. Brenda Maricela Tovar Aguilar. Missing in action. Carlos Alejandro Pérez Caravantes. Vaya, faltó ahora. Y Carlos Manuel Ramos Cepera. Present teacher. Thank you, Carlos. Y vamos a ver, Daniela Alejandra Candray Galvez. Present. Thank you, Daniela. David Antonio López Torres. Absent. And that's it, guys. Thank you for your attention. Thank you so much. I will see you tomorrow at 8 p.m. Thank you, Tisha. Bye, teacher. Wear your pajamas. Good night, teacher. 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 Good night, guys. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Be safe. You tomorrow, Get your pajamas. Get your pajamas. <laughs> Bye.